And you may have noticed new security cameras lining the promenade since you got back from break. Citrus TV reporter Zachary Levine has more about why exactly these new cameras were put up. Zach? Yeah, well, you may have noticed them or you may not have. See, the cameras installed at the end of last semester on the promenade are well concealed and blend in with the light posts that hold them up. I spoke with DPS Chief Bobby Maldonado about why exactly they were installed. You may not have noticed them, but they're there and they're everywhere. Towards the end of last semester, 15 security cameras were installed on light poles along the promenade. The installation of these cameras serves DPS multiple purposes. There, there could be cameras could be there because, you know, just general safety concerns. Um, you know, if we want to see what sort of numbers of, you know, the amount of people that are on, on campus at any particular time. If there's a, an assembly of students, if there is, you know, a, a parade of some sort, and just being able to monitor those sort of things. But not so much that, you know, we're, we're expecting crime. With the quiet, unannounced addition of these cameras, it's only natural some students may be skeptical. Generally, people are, are always concerned about, you know, cameras um, and, and privacy infringement. And I think that that's kind of a, you know, a natural trend that you'll see nationwide and not only here at Syracuse University or in the city of Syracuse. But, you know, I would say to them that, you know, there's, we certainly don't have the, uh, the luxury or the time to monitor those cameras when you think of it. If students think that we're monitoring cameras on the promenade on a daily basis, that's certainly not the case. Now, while there are only 15 cameras on the promenade, each one can provide officers with three separate views, meaning DPS has 45 different camera angles along the promenade. Now, Zachary, what's been the reaction of the student body to these new cameras? Well, one st student I spoke to didn't actually realize, and multiple students actually didn't actually realize the cameras were up. They're well concealed, as you know I mentioned earlier. Um, so they were, you know, a little concerned that DPS didn't send out an email explaining why the cameras were put up. But at the same time, they're just happy with the promenade secure. And now, uh, why exactly are the cameras designed to blend in with a light post? Is there a certain reason as to why that's the design of it? Well, it's not exactly to conceal them from people, for example. It's more to at least get uh, put them in a more natural light, in a natural setting, so they don't look like they're uh, blatantly obvious. They don't stand out for vandals. You know, uh, vandalism is a big problem with cameras. Uh, so if they're somewhat blending in, it's a little harder for uh, vandals to find them. Well, Zachary Levine, great work as always. Thanks so much for being Thank here. Thank you.